You guys, Tools in Action Express. I'm here with Enrique. We just got the Toro Snowmaster 724QXE. Part of their 1000 series. Yes, now, this is the weirdest snowblower I ever saw when I saw it. When I got it, it's one of the best snowblowers we've ever tested here at Tools in Action. I'm gonna tell you why. First of all, I thought it was a two-stage. Didn't you, Eric? I did, yeah. I'm like, this is a two-stage with little wheels. That's weird, I don't know how it's gonna do. Then come to find out, it's not a two-stage. It's a single stage, and it does a pretty good job at throwing snow. Now, the cool thing is, is it has Toro's personal pace system, which Eric's gonna show you right now. The personal pace system is basically as, as hard as you push, as fast as it goes. Guys, and I don't know if you saw our last video, but we had a Toro uh, lawnmower, so it's the same concept. So all you do, as you push, you're gonna be pushing down harder on this. So the faster you walk, the harder you're pushing, just naturally. So you don't even feel it, it's almost like you're walking. So as the farther you push down, the faster it will go. So it keeps up with your pace. Hence right, and pace. this is gonna engage this. So what I like about this system, I mean, this is the most ergonomic, comfortable system I've seen, because otherwise you have to get those big levers and push yep. those levers down. What down. I like about this too is when you pull back on it, see there's a little indent right here? It goes on here, and then so you're not feeling like a huge thing sticking out. So it's almost just like you're just grabbing a regular handlebar. Right, and it has their quick stick. This thing is awesome. Very smooth, very easy. I just can't believe how smooth it is. I know. It's awesome because you can use it with one hand while you're still pushing. Exactly. You don't have to stop. With conventional ones, you have to stop and yep. make your adjustments. So forward and back raises how far you're going to throw the snow, and left or right turns your shoot. Left or right, but it's so smooth. It doesn't feel like there's any, you know, I like that. Yeah, it's it's awesome. You guys, we didn't really have a fresh snow pitfall here. We had a kind of a packed wet snowfall. I went over to my neighbor's driveway and there's tons, he, I didn't plow them out yet, and there's tons of uh, cars that ran over it. So obviously, you know, it's not going to dig down to the ground. No, because there's but, cars over it. Then we had a we had a big snowfall. Then the cars ran over it. Then it froze. What did we get down? Like negative six. Then we had a little yeah. bit of rain. So it was like a crusty... So it wasn't but on the, the fresh pack that nobody stepped on oh. or driven on, it went right through it, no problem. Look what it did right here. This is right. On yeah, the, uh, this is fresh right here. Radio. That's from a fire I had. Now, Eric, hold it up a second real fast if you don't mind. Like down like this. Yeah, you guys, check this out. This is what's really cool too. Is this is plastic right here? Obviously, it's replaceable. But the thing I like about that is my stamped concrete. It's not going to tear it up. It's not going to rip things up. Obviously, adjustable shoes, just like the rest of them, plastic, replaceable, which is. I like it because it's not really going to damage things, you know? Especially, you, like you said, the stamp You have your rubber. It's not always even. It's yeah. Concrete, you know, you have a little bit of up and down groove. You're oh, gonna... dude, the first year I had a snowblower on here, it took a big <laughs> yeah. chunk out of it. I was oh, like, oh, really? I'm never doing this again. Yeah. Yeah. So, overall, you guys. Oh, and, guys, if you don't want to. So, starting it, we start it up, starts right up. If you want to, though, you can also plug it in. It's got an automatic starter. Yes. Plug it in the side, push the button, start it up, man. You're ready to go. Yes. Overall, you guys, I have to say, this is the best snowblower I've tested all year. I mean, you know, a lot of people are going to compare it against the Electric Ego. It's kind of in a different... Two different yeah, they're, they're two different categories, but uh, this thing's the awesome. gas powered in a single stage, man, this thing is awesome. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, and yeah. I mean, and with the Ego, you kind of have to push harder. This thing's just automatic. Now, one thing I did notice, though, is when you get stuck on something, you tend to push that personal pace a little harder, and it might jump forward on you. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only like negative that I could say about this thing. Other than that, I think Toro did a great job designing it. I think it's an awesome, awesome snowblower. Um, Eric's gonna take it to his house now to use it. I kind of want one from my place. Uh, you know, if you guys are in the market for a snowblower, definitely check out the Toro Snowmasters. Toro's been in business for years. You know, they're not a sponsor of ours. This is not a commercial. It's just, man, it's this thing. Like. Okay, yeah, uh... this thing's really impressed us. I mean, from the way it looks online, you know, you're just looking, it just looks weird. But man, after using it, definitely thumbs up. Yeah, very smooth. Two thumbs up, man. Two thumbs, Two thumbs up. Thumbs One from up. Eric, too. You guys, tools in action. Check out our website. Don't forget to go check us out on Instagram and hashtag TA Crew. You guys rock.
Try going back down there. Remember, for more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.